in today's video i'm going to be talking about six types of sperm color yes you actually heard what i said i'm talking about sperm today we are going there we're talking about the sperm color i'm going to be sharing with you the six types of sperm color what actually causes this change in the sperm color and at the end of the video i'm also going to be sharing with you what a healthy sperm look like If you're someone who is in a serious relationship or who has been married and you haven't seen the color of the ejaculates, right, of your husband or your partner, this is an assignment for you. I would like you to sit back and watch this video to the end so that you'll be able to determine after now, you'll be able to determine if your partner has got a healthy um, ejaculate or he's got an unhealthy ejaculate. Now, the aim of this video is for you to help your partner to be able to say honey something is wrong i think we need to go to the doctors or oh, honey i think we are all perfect we are all set we are all good to go yeah so that's the essence of the video my name is precious if you're seeing me for the first time i create content like this if you enjoy it please press the subscribe button and also the notification bell to all my returning subscribers thank you so so much and um, i just want to say thank you to every one of you the best or the most important thing you can do for me today is to make sure that you press the like button because that like button goes a long way making youtube to recommend this video now six types of sperm color are you aware that there are different types of sperm color and what the sperm color actually means so when i'm talking about sperm i'm actually talking about both the sperm and the semen i'm talking about the ejaculate right so i'm going to be using the word ejaculate or i'm going to be using the word semen of course we know that the semen contains the sperm the first one i'm going to be talking about is the yellowish um, white color yellowish white color now this sperm color is as a result of when people start getting older or when men starts getting older the color of the sperm actually starts changing this is not a bad thing it's actually normal or when a, when a, someone who is actually young eats food that is very high in sulfur we all know that sulfur is a bit bright and yellowish so it affects the color of the semen it doesn't act necessarily mean that something is wrong so that actually is the reason why an ejaculate can actually have a yellowish but white color just a mixture of a yellow color but there's a bit of a white in it so this is the reason why you have this type of color now, now the second color we're going to be talking about is when the ejaculate is yellow yes some ejaculates can come out yellow this is when the ejaculate mixes with the we with the urine in the urethra or in the body let me just use that word in the body then what happens is that the ejaculate comes out as yellow you know the way a we would normally be when you we have a we or a we that um has is conk literally conk or concentrated your ejaculate can come out that way and the reason why you can actually have a, an ejaculate that is yellow is when you have jaundice jaundice can actually cause a uh, ejaculate that is yellow another thing that can cause it is when you have prostate infection and another thing that, that can cause is when you have leukocytospermia so these are the three major reasons or three major causes of you having a an ejaculate that is yellow if your partner is got an ejaculate that is yellow something is not right your partner needs to be seen or you need to be seen as soon as possible another color that most people actually have is 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 green ejaculate yes green ejaculate this is when you have um the person have an um, acute infection green ejaculate is not normal under any circumstance and um, please if you know that you have green ejaculate or you've experienced it one off or randomly or your partner has experienced it i would encourage you to go see the doctor because it's not normal now the next color we're going to be talking about is when the ejaculate is red brownish so it's got a bit of red and it, it looks a little bit like a brown ejaculate this tells you that your ejaculate or your semen is mixed with blood yes it's mixed with blood and this is not a good sign a lot of men actually go through stuff because they are men and this is their powerhouse this is the area where they feel like they need to dominate they don't like to share this is why i'm making this video so that you that is watching me you would look out for the ejaculates that comes out of your partner when you look at that ejaculate you'll be able to determine if it's a healthy ejaculate or not a healthy ejaculate a lot of women have been in a relationship for a long time and they have never ever seen what the ejaculate of their partner looks like 
God is speaking to you today go and look at what the ejaculate look like you don't necessarily have to uh, ask your partner to do it outside if that's not what you want but every single time you have intercourse or you have sex what is going to happen is that as soon as the ejaculate comes wherever it wants to come there's still going to be a bit coming out even after the whole do thing has been done okay even after everything has been has been done the ejaculates a bit of it is still going to come out so use the opportunity to check what color your partner's ejaculate actually is another color we're going to be talking about is black yes it's that bad ejaculate can actually be black what causes a black ejaculate this is when the man has a serious spinal cord injury right when you have a senior a serious spinal cord injury there is a chance that um the injury may affect the production of your semen or the ejaculate and this can cause your ejaculate to be black now this is serious this is not a joke this is a serious serious condition that you want to is in fact i'm sure that you have a spinal cord injury you're not going to be at home you'll be in the hospital and everything is going to be sorted there are so many factors that actually affect the color of a semen don't go anywhere because i am still going to tell you what a healthy ejaculate looks like but before going there i want to tell you what actually can cause the three or the four major things that can actually cause the color of your uh, of a sperm or, or ejaculate to actually change the first one is food the food we actually eat is very very important i don't know if you guys have eaten um, um red velvet cake right when you eat red velvet cake there's a chance that your number two is going to be a bit reddish brown right so the food we eat is very very important if you eat a food that is very very high in sulfur it is going to affect you. so if it's, if you find out that your partner's ejaculate is a bit yellowish you want to go back and look at the kind of food that you've been you guys have been consuming there is a chance that the, you've been eating food that is very high in sulfur so diet or food can actually affect the color of a man's ejaculate of course sperm mixed with urine we've talked about that sperm mixed with blood we've talked about that infection can actually cause it as well so these are the four major causes or four major reasons why um you have a color of a sperm or ejaculate that doesn't look right now what is a healthy sperm color what color of ejaculate that when you see it you know that this is a healthy this is a sperm a healthy ejaculate that can actually make bring about life now there are three three important key factors or three important characteristics of a healthy sperm number one it has to be clear number two is whitish in color and number three is grayish in color now it's clear it does it's not mixed with blood it's not mixed with anything you can see it is clear secondly it has a little bit of whitishness in it it has a bit of white in it and thirdly it has a bit of gray color in it so it's a combination of clear white and gray ejaculate if your partner has a ejaculate that is clear that is gray and that is white all in one you have a healthy partner but if your partner has a different color um, that other than what i've just mentioned you may want to go and see the doctor and make sure that everything is okay now if you're trying to conceive other than going for semen analysis where you go to the hospital and check that your partner is okay the first step you can actually do is to use your eyes to look at the semen yourself and see if it looks all right if it looks all right at least with that physical eyes that's a good sign before you now start going for further investigation and all of that have you gotten something out of this video yes i know you have please i would like you to press the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed or you should also give me a thumbs up if before you leave this video at least a thumbs up before you leave this video so that someone else will be able to watch this video and know the different types of sperm color what causes the sperm color and what a healthy sperm looks like because the aim is that you want to know what a healthy sperm looks like so i'm going to be reading some comments and this comment like i said i'm going to be reading comments two comments every time i post a video so the first comment is from v m she says or he says thank you my lovely i am praying god will bless me with a baby boy and hopefully soon i will share my testimony with you thank you for making lovely videos for us i have seen every single one wow god bless you thank you so much VM. 
this kind of comments actually make me feel like is what what i'm doing is actually what it thank you so much i appreciate you so the second uh, message is from what comment is from khalid which says i used your method as you stated i used a clear blue ovulation kit and got a steady smiley face i'm praying for a boy this time because i have two girls already i'm one month pregnant now please also pray for me um, I'm praying for you as well. I pray that God will bless you and your desires will come true. So guys, thank you so much for watching. The next video I would like you to watch is the video I made on how to use a um, clear ovulation kit and a thermometer to actually pinpoint when ovulation has taken place. You may want to watch it right now. Thank you so much. Bye.